hello guys and welcome back to today's video my name is Zeke the programming guy in today's video guys I want to show you how to fix problems with TikTok live studio so if you're having a bad experience with the TikTok live studio it could be based on two factors which I'm going to share and show you how you can fix it so I'm going to be going really straight to the point so I'm not going to waste your time in today's video so um we're going to be starting with the first one so the first thing um you need to do in order not to have a bad experience using the tiktok live studio when i say bad experience i mean like um slow performance and some features not working in the tiktok live studio application all right so if you don't want to experience that the first thing you have to do is to get live access so you have to get live access on the TikTok live uh, studio before you can be able to make use of some of the features right here. Um, so if you don't have um, TikTok live access, then you can't even go live on the TikTok live studio. So that's the first thing you have to make sure of. So um, I have a video on how you can actually get live access. It's very, very simple. You can do that from your TikTok uh, mobile app and i'll add the video <coughs> i'll add the video at the end of this one so you can check that out so once you have live access then you can go live on the tiktok live studio application all right and also if you don't want um to uh, face some slow performance in the tiktok live studio application then there is something you have to do you have to make sure that before you open the tiktok live studio application you have to ensure that your internet connection is turned on if your t internet connection is not turned on before you click before double tapping on this tiktok live studio app then you are not going to get access to some features and you're going to experience some slow performance in the app so you have to make sure that your internet connection is turned on before clicking on the tiktok application on your desktop so once you open it go ahead and log into your account and everything works smoothly so this is um, actually the two major problems the two major factors that could cause some bad experience in the tiktok live studio so once you have it fixed then um, everything is soft for you so guys this is how you can actually fix some problems with tiktok live studio application hope this guide was helpful if it was give this video a like and equally subscribe to get more and also if you want to learn more about the tiktok live studio application i have a full playlist that i'm going to add at the end of this one so that you can learn how to use um, the tiktok live studio application thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in my next video